What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Nash here. Welcome back to the channel. I apologize if my hair is a bit of a mess right now. I am so upset right now. I just, I, my, my PS3, I, I, I will show you my PS3. Give me one second. Hold on. That right there is my PS3. And my PS3 completely stopped on me. Not once, but twice. And I missed one whole match. And like literally half of the main event. Literally I did. I am so upset right now. But at least I was able to watch the event. So tonight I will give you guys the results from Wrestlemania. Um, I gotta try and breathe for a second. Um, so we kick it off with the, with the Cruiserweight Championship match. To kick off the entire show. Tony Nese pins Buddy Murphy with the running knees to become our new Cruiserweight Champion. Mad props to Tony Nese after winning the tournament um, a couple of weeks ago on 205 Live. And then, of course, Carmella eliminating Sarah Logan in the final in, as the final two. Carmella, Sarah Logan. Mella eliminates Logan to win the WrestleMania Women's Battle Royal. And Kurt Hawkins, of all people, actually breaking his losing streak by rolling up Dash Wilder to win the Raw Tag Team titles alongside Zack Ryder. And don't mind the light. It, if, it, it, it does that a lot. And then uh, Braun Strowman eliminates both Colin Jost and Michael Che to win the Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal. Congrats to him. So that, that was the kickoff show. Main card. Um, first match is actually the WWE Universal T Championship. Uh, first time in history. Seth Rollins actually pins Brock Lesnar to finally win the title. Um, Brock Lesnar is not is not getting getting his rematch. We all know that with that no with the no with the no rematch clause still in effect. Lesnar ain't getting it anytime soon. So so huge congrats to Seth Rollins. He earned it. And then a AJ Styles hits. Randy Orton with the phenomenal forearm to pick up a victory, which again that, that that's a huge victory. I mean, going up against a 13-time world champion in Orton, it's a huge victory. And then of course the Usos um, hit the double loose on Sheamus to re to retain the SmackDown Tag Team Titles. Ricochet and Alistair Black first WrestleMania they knocked it. They, dude, they they were on point. But again, Usos won. Uh, Shane, uh, Shane McMahon, uh, The Miz, False Count Anywhere, right where the production area is, The Miz hits a suplex on Shane McMahon, and that backfired because Shane McMahon picked up a victory. Um, yeah. Um, the Iconics defeating the, actually pinning the, the Divas of Doom to win the WWE Women's Tag Team titles, of course, under, under Fatal 4-Way Rules. Anything involving multiple teams or individuals, champions do not have to be pinned or submitted to lose the titles. And then after 11 years, Kofi Kingston finally becomes the WWE Champion by pinning Daniel Bryan with the Trouble in Paradise. I was in tears for that. I was just like absolutely in tears. That was absolutely amazing. And then of course, and then of course, Samoa Joe, uh, in quick fashion. Quick fashion hits, literally applies the Coquina Clutch on, on Mysterio to retain the WWE United States title. And then Roman Reigns, first match back, as his first singles match back in six months, he defeats uh, Drew, Drew McIntyre with probably one of, the, one of the most wildest spears I had ever seen. And again, I did miss this match, but I was able to find out who won. And Triple H actually did defeat actually did defeat Batista. But tomorrow morning, I will definitely rewatch that and the main event. And yeah, um, Baron Corbin defeating Kurt Angle in Kurt Angle's final match with the end of days. Big highlight of of Corbin's career. And then the Demon Finn Balor returns. And at the Demon, Finn Balor, makes his debut at WrestleMania, but returns to the WWE and defeats Bobby Lashley to become the two, a two-time Intercontinental Champion. Leo Rush, if you saw Leo Rush's face, he was tripping out. He was tripping like, whoa, 
that's freaky. Yeah, Demon is freaky. And then, of course, the main event, um, Becky Lynch. This is highly controversial, but um, Becky Lynch actually gives Ronda Rousey her first loss um, in WWE um, to win both the Raw and SmackDown women's titles. My opinion, I think Becky Lynch should drop the Raw, the Raw women's title to... I guess me. I guess someone to like. I guess to maybe Ruby Riot. I think Ruby truly deserves it, and then have Becky stay on SmackDown. And then of course the attendance record, which is uh, for 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 MetLife Stadium. Um, sorry, sorry about that, guys. That was just my brother Alito. Um, the WrestleMania, the WrestleMania attendance record is eighty two thousand two hundred sixty five. That's amazing. Uh, we got to see the Doctor of Economics, John Cena return. Um, you know, obviously Hulk Hogan, you know, DX, you know, Hall of Famers and whatnot. It was amazing. Um, so, so with that being said, that's gonna do it for the WrestleMania result. Again, I'm just gonna get this uploaded. And I'll have a little bit of dinner, and I'm going and I'm going to bed. I am super tired, and I'm very upset. So. Um, so, with that being said, thank, thank you guys for watching. Um, if you guys enjoyed, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys subscribe. And turn on the post notification bell so y'all don't miss out on any new, new content that comes your way. Again, the channel goes full-time starting this week. Um, I'm going to be, do, do, I'm, I'm be doing some. I'm going to be switching things up a bit with the channel. Again, same, you know, same content, Yu-Gi-Oh, WWE, just different topics, if you will. And on that, this is your boy Nash, signing out.